Hey everyone, I'm at Morgan's farm. Um, I broke in, but uh, I'm not gonna tell you how, so you can't do it. I used to volunteer here, so I know some secrets. Um, I'm sure John wouldn't mind either. He's uh, probably enjoying his Memorial Day. It's Monday, actually. And if I can't get him on an interview, I'm gonna use this one. So you just gotta deal with me here from a guy uh, one degree away from the farmer. But um, yeah, so it's Cedar Grove. Morgan's Farm, it's right off of Route 23 called Pompton Plains, specifically in this area. Um, there's no animals, it's all produce and it's all organic. Um, and they do a sale on Saturdays uh, from now, which is May until October. And they've got all kinds of lettuces, peppers, um, tons of tomatoes, all those um, metal pieces are tomatoes grow up these lines with weights on them. Let me show you real quick. And he's got lots of different heirloom varieties of tomatoes. But so you put a string and put a weight on the end of it and tie it up above. And, oh, that one's loose. Uh, and that, uh, that will uh, be there for the tomatoes to grow up uh, along instead of having a stake that eventually towards the top, you know, sometimes they, they don't have good ground fixture and they They sway or even fall down um, I know he's got potatoes and I'm not sure what's under there. He's got lots of kale. He's got peas that are growing up that too um, All right, I'm gonna run so the video doesn't have a lot of lag time All right now we're and he's got levels, which were cool. I was here when we were installing these these beds and then putting up walls. And um, it was a uh, interesting operation um, to get it all done. But um, the uh, the lowest level down here, you can see there's more lettuce. And I don't know if those are eggplants or something. I'm not sure. I don't think they are. Um, but he's got squash that are going to start to do their thing soon. Um, yeah, so it's like a typical, uh, not typical, but a produce farm that has typical varieties of foods, but they're all organic. And John's put so much of his time into this. It's called Morgan's Farm. He named it after the, who historically farmed the land. Um, I consider it John's farm. But... Um, he doesn't get any profit from it. He just, it's a philanthropy kind of thing. Uh, and yeah, and I'm here. I would steal some produce, but I've been learning so much about foraging that um, I'm gonna go get me some garlic mustard and some burdock, I believe I saw, and a couple other things I don't know the names of, but I know they're edible. So, um, so I will leave this for the other people to eat and and pay for all right but it's a, it's well worth it and john sells it at a very good price it's not he's not trying to make tons of money and it's non-profit i believe all right but hopefully i get a video with john uh today is monday and i'm not sure if i'm going to pass through cedar grove directly again i'm doing some zigzagging in essex county around here but i'm going to newark next or east orange and then newark all right Hasta luego.